he'd do anything to hurt someone I cared about. I was disappointed. You chose to call yourself Trey Mitchell. But now, I'm grateful. Corinthos can never, never know you're my son. Joseph Mitchell Scully the third. Right, Dad. Look, I won't. I won't let anyone know you're my father. But no, no, I gotta no, know. No, son. No buts. I know how Sonny thinks. He was all set up to kill me when the cops showed. It's kind of ironic, you know. Arresting me saved my life. But Sonny didn't get what he wanted, and he's seeing red right about now. Wishing it was my blood. Dad, if Sonny set you up for something you didn't do, then we, hey, we gotta. Hey, hey. hey. Easy. Don't worry. I'm getting out of here. And when I do, I'll make sure that Sonny isn't a problem for either one of us. Why does Sonny hate you so much, Dad? It goes back a long time. Long time? Like, like what? Like when you were kids? Yeah. yeah. There was this girl. No. She was smart, beautiful, filled with fire. Corinthos had the hots for her, but she liked me better. Come on, Dad. Seriously, this can't be over. Just some girl. Wait. Sonny had an ego, son, that you wouldn't believe. I mean, he couldn't swallow the fact that I was better than him. And the guy... The guy wanted everything that I had. He even wanted the things that I didn't. Like your father's business. Yeah. Sonny's old man. He had nothing. He gave him nothing. But your grandpa Joe, he was a major player. He used to control the whole neighborhood. And Corinthos wanted in and wanted me out. I still can't believe that my grandfather was a gangster. Son. I tried to shield you the best I could. Yeah, well, you know, Dad, considering I had absolutely no clue, I think you did a pretty damn good job. You have to understand something. In that life, that world, vendettas get handed down. New generations become targets for old hostilities. If Sonny gets wind, you're my boy. He won't think twice. He'd love nothing better than to torture me by hurting my son. You understand? Yeah, so then this, this whole reality show thing is probably pretty stupid. Look, yeah, I'm, I'm going to tell Christina we're dropping the whole thing as soon as I get back. That's an even worse idea. Sonny is not a man you want as an enemy. He's ruthless, irrational. If he finds out you're my son, he'll hate you on sight. Yeah, well, he already doesn't like me. Did Sonny lay a hand on you? No, no, Dad. He just thinks I'm trying to exploit his family, which... I mean, let's be honest, I kind of am. What, well, so? I mean, it's not like you invented reality television. I mean, this is how the business works. Sonny's daughter was the one who helped you come up with the concept. You didn't force her to participate. And still, Dad, I don't know if this is such a smart move. It's too late. You drop it, Corinthos could get suspicious. And we cannot afford to have him sniffing around. Right, so I'm just supposed to sit back and pretend that, that I don't know anything about this. Pretend that I don't want to smash his face through a wall? Look, the, Come goal, on, the goal is to hide in plain sight. All right, now look at me here. Sonny, can't know who you are or that you're connected to me in any way. So do nothing. You'll be doing exactly what I need you to do. Bring that bastard to his knees, where he belongs. This is crazy, Dad. You're, you're sitting here rotting for a crime you didn't patience, commit. Patience, son. But Sonny's responsible, not you. It's gonna be okay. How? Let me worry about that. You just go back to Port Charles and you get on with that reality show. Without Sonny figuring out who I am. Exactly. In that way, when I decide to strike back, that SOB will never see it coming.